Hey guys, welcome to Grace Take and today in this video, let's have a quick look at this uh, NoGuard Beta 2. And the later part of the video, I'm uh, doing a question and association as well as the gaming review, um, the gaming performance in this ROM. So stay tuned and keep watching this video. So I have installed CPUZ application to see what's going on inside. So let me open the CPUZ application. As you can see, the amazing part is that the um, CPU is clocked at 2 GHz. As you can see, 468 MHz to 2 GHz. That means the highest frequency is 2 GHz. That means it uh, will run faster. That means your phone will run faster. And uh, this is this will help you in gaming and overall uh, for good performance you will get better performance from this one and also uh, ram is a little bit uh, more in capacity as well as memory management is good and let's take a look at the sensor as you can see all the sensors are working fine no issues i think game rotation vector sensor will work well while gaming only so all the sensors are working no issues here so thumbs up for that so guys uh, now i'll try to answer all your question uh, regarding the video the android nougat beta 2 video that i posted earlier so the first question is uh, from kushal who asked me which camera did he use and the answer is uh, nikal coolpix s6900 I have uh, recently bought it and I have made uh, some videos regarding it and kindly check my channel and the playlist is gadget reviews you will get uh, the sample videos and so on on that camera if you really want to buy a, a blocking camera uh, under uh, 10,000 rupees or around 10,000 rupees then, then this is the best camera that you can get which can shoot 1080p video with a very good quality and the next question is from Nico and so the first question is does YouTube run 1080p at 60 fps yes uh, it can run 1080p at 60 fps how is gaming and overall performance and you can see so now let me show you the gaming performance of it i have installed uh, the export extreme game and i'm going to play it and show you the gaming performance
and surprisingly gaming performance is amazing guys so there is a gaming review for you and overall performance is uh, good enough for daily usage I would say uh, it's pretty much smooth and the RAM management is really excellent here any place to issues with some apps or does it crash no there is no place to issues uh, uh, with some apps yeah uh, I found some apps are crashing and uh, if you install apps from Play Store, then uh, there is uh, less chance to crash. And uh, the system apps that are crashing is uh, the settings app. Sometimes it crashing uh, when I'm switching between the scenes in the same settings. Um, then the uh, settings apps is crashing. And any bugs? Yes, there are some uh, bugs here. And the major bugs is um, the video is not recording actually it is recording the video but it can't save the video as well as it, it can't record audios so it's the major bug I would say although calling is working fine no issues regarding the calling and uh, so you are asking about the battery life um, the battery life is uh, decent uh, nothing extraordinary that we can expect from a stock google chrome it's uh, not that extraordinary it's uh, good better than uh, the zen ui that i have reviewed earlier and it's good you can get um, around four hours of screen on time with your normal typical usage and the score um sorry i didn't check the anti the score yet because i don't have enough time to do uh, install the Antutu and run the benchmark. I'm sorry for that. Uh, actually, I really it doesn't matter um, regarding the benchmark score. And now it is actually because it's pretty old device now. And the Lenovo K3 Note is really old now, and the chipset uh, which is um, in it is really old now. Uh, so I think um, there's no reason to. Um, uh, to calculate the benchmark so it will be your more or less uh, 50,000 mark uh, that's it and the boot time yes uh, the boot time is really fast and really fast compared to another ROMs Android 7 versus Android 6 actually I'm really liking the Android 7 it's really good I don't know if uh, uh, another OS will come how it feels but it's really good um, but right now the stability um, is better on Android 6 so I hope uh, the question I have answered um, so I hope I have answered all the, all the questions Nico uh, Javi check uh, problem with share it sending option not working it may be a problem I don't know uh, but I haven't checked the share it app but it may uh, not work and the hotspot is also working so in a hotspot a tethering hotspot is uh, no problem you can try another app it may work gfs not working yes gfs are working uh, why you are asking I don't know camera is very bad I don't know camera is uh, camera is uh, recording um, I'm not recording the video but uh, it's capturing the photo very well and the photo qualities are really good I don't know what you are asking for thank you for your comments um, this is uh, no you can't get voltage um, in this room as well as uh, there is no room that you can enable the voltage uh, so it's really sad uh, for me as well as you also yes video recording is not working child um, geo4g and this is an interesting question Ravi Singh has asked uh, that geo4g is working or not actually I have tried to register the geo4g network and it may work but it didn't work for me uh, actually the problem is that um, it was uh, not automatically uh, restarting the network when I'm searching manually the uh, network name that Yatel 4G, Vodafone 3G, uh, 4G or Geo 4G all are in numeric like 8004331 uh, or something like that 
so I can't uh, recognize the Geo 4G network that's why I can't restart the Geo 4G you may get uh, the Geo 4G signal because uh, 4G will work fine no issues and um, Kartik is asking bro I am running uh, 6.0 stock ROM on K3 node is there any need to flash a custom boot image for flashing recovery or I can directly flash it uh, bro if you are using uh, uh, stock room you then you ha you have that stock recovery so you need to flash a custom recovery like PWRP or CWM recovery <coughs> so that you can flash uh, the what do you say the rooms in it any bugs or an issue yes there, there are bugs I have uh, already mentioned all the bugs and any bugs camera works yes camera works and there are bugs uh, but in daily usage uh, you will know uh, you will you don't have uh, that much of issue if you don't record videos or something like that RAM management is really good battery is uh, good enough Volt is not working uh, but Geo may work but I haven't um, got the signal yet because uh, I can't recognize um, the Geo 4G network. Um, the link on Needroom was uh, not updated so how come this is more stable? Uh, Shiva uh, this is um, actually beta version 2 actually I have reviewed uh, beta 1 it was really unstable and uh, can't use as a daily purpose but this beta 2 version is uh, they can use it daily there is no force closing um, or any major hiccups that you can't use um, this room but you can use this from very smoothly without any issue now major compromises um, I think the video uh, part that's on the audio part uh, because uh, the audio is not recording uh, the ok google uh, functionality is also not working I have checked so the ok google functionality is not working because uh, the uh, microphone is not working micro recording sound I've installed another apps um, to record video as well as the audio the audio is also not recording even the video is not saving uh, since you did not why system uh, what system was you running when you uh, flash when you flash to room actually when you, there is no need to uh, wipe your system because uh, in case you if the flashing process uh, get failure then you will be in trouble because you have wiped the system then there will be no system to reboot so you need to flash then you need to flash uh, another system then you can uh, access your phone uh, then you can use your phone so it's risky do not um, wipe system just wipe data Dalvi cache and cache that's it so that's it for this long video I'm really sorry for that that I have wasted your expensive time and do you like these types of video that I have answered the questions from your comments uh, in a video as a question answer session? If you like it, uh, do hit the like button and also let me know if you uh, in future uh, do I make these types of video that uh, can help you. So let me know in the comments below. Thank you guys for watching. You guys always have a great day.